Where's my dad? I don't know. What is that? If you read the book, The Last Thing You Told Me, was there something in it that took you into your portrayal of Bailey? And if you didn't, I still wanted to ask, did you have like a guiding North Star that you centered her character around when you were portraying her? Yes, um, I did read the book and it was it was a really great experience. I just devoured it. I read it on audio and just listened to it over two days because I was just so in it. Um, and I think for finding Bailey as a character, I was really interested in, and I'm always interested in characters who have a big change in their lives and characters who change over time. And we see that with Bailey. She has a big kind of catalyst at the beginning of her story to kind of propel her into a, a big time of change. And so for finding that, um, there were a few things that I drew on from my experiences with my parents or my sister or um, growing up and traveling and, and childhood memories and things like that. So yeah, that's that's where I where I found her. What was really interesting to me is the first the first episode when we see Bailey um, before she knows that her dad has disappeared, and we see that she's really into musical theater. And in pre production, we spoke about what that means to Bailey. Why is she so into musical theater and singing? Does that come from one of the only stories she knows about her mum? Maybe maybe. Maybe she just knows that her mum liked to sing and that's where she kind of held on, she held on to that and drew from that. And for me personally, um, my mum is very musical and she's in a choir and grew up playing instruments and her, both of her parents are musicians and worked um, as music teachers. So that was something that I really connected to, um, Bailey's connection with music and how that helps her in her life, how that grounds her, how she is able to explore her feelings through song and music when she doesn't know, el know what else to say. <laughs>